Well, good evening, good morning, good afternoon, good something. Welcome to this. Welcome to Quarantine Q&A with your hosts, Haley. And me. And Dean. Well, hope you guys are doing okay out there. As you've noticed, there really hasn't... It's fine. There hasn't been a lot of stuff on the channel. Uh, our life has been exceptionally boring between trying to get taxes done and then just not having anywhere to go because it's... It's like, where are you gonna go? Corona time! I mean, it's, I suppose you could make trips to the supermarket, but to be honest with you, I don't wanna go there, so way too many people. Our good friend Fro, Jason from Stereo Kings, up over there. I said up, oh, up and over there. Oh, oh. In Oregon, <laughs> sent us a list. How many questions mm -hmm. are there? Hi. I don't know the questions. Obviously. Sent us 10 questions. I asked for Haley, I says, hey, listen, Fro sent us 10 questions. Do you want to do them? So that we could at least put out something, maybe entertaining. And what did you say? Sure. This is exactly what she said. She had that much excitement. She was like, yeah, sure. Okay. I said it was more exciting. No, you didn't. You're such a liar. I said, oh, cool. All right. So without further ado, let's go. She hasn't seen the questions yet. I'm kind of scared. And honestly, I haven't read them either because I haven't had time. You ready? Oh, yeah. Let's By the do way, this thing. Five Star Splash shirt. No. <laughs> Why? They, the Boring Life shirt's up there now, too. You get a Boring Life shirt. Five Star Splash shirt. No comment. <laughs> Question number one. I got to tear off my glasses so I can read this. Old. Small. What is your favorite food? <laughs> I talk about this all the time. Now, I have three. <laughs> when I'm Me holding too. up four fingers. I have three favorite foods. Me too. And I've slowly but surely, I think Put right now- Put your glasses on, you look crazy. Oh, sorry. I've cut them down to two, but then I added a third back, so I'm at three again. Anyways, what are your, what is your favorite foods? Okay, chicken tenders. Yep. Cheese pizza, mac and cheese. What Easy. kind of mac and cheese? I mean, any mac and cheese is fine. That's not true. But I like baked mac and cheese. I was gonna say, you're a very finicky macaroni and cheese eater. Yeah. And you also liked crappy boxed macaroni and cheese. The kind it's you have to stuff. add milk to. Like the and cheap cheese stuff powder. with cheese powder. <laughs> Loves that stuff. It's good. Her and Sue will go through a whole box of that by themselves. The swirls, craft swirls, oh yeah. Do you know what my three things are? Chicken wings, french fries, and pizza. So swap out chicken rings for ice cream because if you recall i haven't had chicken ice wings cream now. isn't a food it's a food in my world no, but i have not to dessert i cut chicken wings out i haven't had chicken wings now and just because you haven't had chicken wings since... doesn't mean they're not your favorite yeah but i haven't had them since like november i've moved on so if we were back in the past it'd be chicken wings burgers and fries <laughs> pretty much all right question number two what is your favorite sport soccer now we've had this debate on whether running is a sport it's, it's a in sport. the it's in the olympics she had told me running isn't a sport. I was like, how, how can it not be a sport? But obviously mine is running. I'm not a big fan of team activities. Yeah, he sucks. <laughs> He's mean. Why am I mean? I don't know how mean I like team activities <laughs> being not mean. You're mental. Oh. You could turn the computer off. All right, question number three. If you could live anywhere else, where would you live? Oh, I never thought about this question. That's why they're good. Palm Harbor. <laughs> no, where in the world would you live? Palm Harbor. We've lived in Palm Harbor, you nut. <laughs> In it's so bright state, in here. Like, yes, where would I, you live? Like, I, if you could live in your, <laughs> you know, like, pick, pick a place you'd like to live. Pick a other, place. <laughs> yes. Fickle you fick, prick. A place where you'd live other than Florida. Okay, I've only been to Michigan, Hawaii, and Washington. And California. In California. I would never live in California. Really? I thought you liked California. I mean, okay, yeah. California is awesome, but like, it's too populated. So, and right. And everything there is overpriced. Well, it's yeah. like Disney, but like a state. Well, the question is whether you'd live there. It doesn't mean you, like, you're not Sorry, gonna, you might not be able to it. afford to live there. You could just live there. Where is yours? Um, I'd probably live in Hawaii for a while. I thought Washington was pretty cool. Washington was beautiful, but I don't know if I could live there. Why? It's just because it's cold. Why snows would you want to live in Hawaii? Because I like the weather and I like the green. I don't know. There's just stuff yeah. I could do there. I don't think I'd live there forever, though. There's really not a lot. <laughs> no, I think it'd be like a couple years, you know, and then move on to someplace else. Question number yeah. four. That's a hard question. Did I even answer? Yes. Yeah, I said Washington. Similar to where you'd like to live, but if you could vacation anywhere, where would you vacation? Now, this one shouldn't be too hard for you because there's, I know one place that you keep bugging me to take you. Alaska. <laughs> Or Canada. <laughs> Canada. I mean, it's almost the same place. No, but yes, you'd say Canada. Yeah, I really want to go to Canada. Which I have no idea why. Okay, I've seen a lot of people go there, and where they go is like 
It's really cool. Yeah, but it's a big place. You okay, kind of have to know I, where, I to know go. where to go. <laughs> okay. And I know the video that I saw. I think Canada would be really fun. I want to go to Alaska as well. And I really want to go to Paris. I want to go to Disney in Paris. Yeah, I could see that. You know, it would definitely be, I think it would definitely be one of the Disneys for sure. If I was to pick one, uh, was it Shanghai Disney looks pretty cool. Yeah. Tokyo Disney, one of those would probably be on my list of places to go for sure. In the continental United States, probably like the Grand Canyon or something. Basic. I don't know. I, it's very basic. I'm a basic guy. NYC, baby? No, I've been there. It's not. It's something. When? When I was a kid. It's not the same. It's changed. Anyways. I want to go to Broadway. With your posse? Will your wheels, Next question. Will your wheels spin slow? Number five. What is your favorite beverage? Water. These things are all over the board. I mean, that would okay. be mine. But yeah, no. I like, I have three. Okay. Water. Yep. Well, I have four. Water. <laughs> Do Capri tell. Capri Sun. Yeah. What flavor Capri Sun? Because that's a sticky one. Strawberry kiwi. Um, I like strawberry kiwi. And I think what's in there now is like tropical splash. No, I think it's like Pacific splash. I don't like orange splash. tasting. Anyways. Yeah. Dr. Pepper and Sprite with fruit punch. Oh, that combination. Yeah, it's so good. So the sad thing in all of that is you can't have Dr. Pepper. Yeah. Yeah, because it's got caffeine and it gives her migraines. I thought I debunked the theory yeah. of me like not having caffeine, but then I had caffeine. I had it twice. And within like a couple of days, I had a really bad headache. So I'm just going to say no caffeine, which is fine. I did it for a long time. So um, Mine would be like IBC root beer, Verner's ginger ale and that new butter beer stuff i really dig in that wait mom did you get that for you no mom did not give me the butter beer i know mom yeah what is that i don't know it's just like <laughs> i don't know hand drive we do in grease <laughs> Also. Root beer is good. I love root beer. Yeah, IBC. I mean, I'll take any root I beer. I like mug root beer. From Mugs the good. Fountain. Mugs and yeah, oh yeah. Fountain. Oh, but I also it. like um, a little vanilla ice cream in it. <laughs> you know, root beer float. We only have water from the valley. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. All right. Question number six. You like that song? Uh, no. I'm sure it's one of the I guarantee teenage none movie. Of you people. I'm sure it's the. I'm sure it's the. Oh, no. it's our green bean casserole. <laughs> I'm sure it's one of the genre that I call your teenage. It uh, has um, Amanda Bynes in it. There you go. <laughs> I'm kidding. Yeah. It's okay. Hillary Duff. Duff. All the same. Question number six. If you could have any job, what would it be? A counseling psychologist. And for, hopefully that's not going to be a question. And adolescents. Yeah, that, that's what she's going to college for. Yeah. So. Easy peasy. That was. Yeah, as long as she's. I'm going to beat her to do it. Oh my gosh. Um, uh, quiet on the set. I don't, I don't know. Kidding. I don't know what mine would be. Um, I think it'd have to do something in marketing, marketing or training, like standing in front of a group of people. No yeah. thanks. <laughs> I like it. That sounds. Like it. You know, marketing, training, stand-up comedian. You get that? That sounds terrible. Even though I'm not funny, <laughs> so that would be no good. I'd suck at it. Ew. <laughs> that face. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yeah. Ten degrees lower. Question number seven. What is your biggest? Fear. The dark. No, no, no. For the people who know me, it's water. <laughs> what? I'm afraid of the ocean. Oh, that's different. That's not water. I mean, a cup of water. It's, it's, it's not like we're doing signs to here. Rush. To the rush. <laughs> Maddie always makes fun of me. She makes you want to pee? No, makes fun of me. Because you're afraid of the ocean? Mm -hmm. What's wrong with being afraid of the ocean? We live in Florida. Yeah, but I'm not big Anyways, on I mean, it's I not really like you see me like, jumping there. I don't like the dark. I don't like dark water, but it's not and like I that don't, fear. I don't like the water. I don't like water. I don't like being wet. What do you mean I like being wet? We have a swimming pool right yeah, there. Yeah, but I volunteer to get in the pool. You bug me to get into the pool. That's like, not the same. That's different. I so want confused. that to happen. Well, as we all know, my fear is frogs, but... It's, oh, you know, God, disgusting. Yeah, and frogs live in dark, murky water, so... I don't go into dark, murky water. Alligators are there too, but you know, whatever. Like, what do you think my fear was? I have no idea. I don't um, know. It kind of changes frequently. It's so. the dark. Okay. I've always been afraid of the dark. Question number eight. If you could meet anyone past or present, who would it be? Like anybody. Famous, not famous. I know. Relative. Who's yours? I would really like to spend some time with Arnold Schwarzenegger. I think that would be a, a I high saw point. him, guys. Yeah, yeah. I think, you know, I would spend some time, like, you know, know like, sit down and have a conversation. 
To me, that's that would so be pretty funny. cool. I would take Sylvester Stallone as a really close second. Like if they happen to be having lunch together and I crush it. Yeah, if there was all I'm three of them and they're like, hey, Dean, come sit down. We love your show. You know, have a seat. Let's talk. Okay, yeah. that's... It's reaching, I know, that's but so is the likelihood true. of me yeah. sitting down with them, um, so let's play along here. I don't want to be a loser and say, like, a soccer player. Why? Why would that be a loser? You totally know. dig that. I, know. I mean, if you could sit down and have lunch with... Uh, Julie Ertz. Yeah. I would. Yeah, or the whole team for that matter. Or a fellow YouTuber. <laughs> I'm just kidding. No, yeah, that's fine. I know. What's a her fellow name? YouTuber. Well, okay. Colleen Ballinger. Yeah. I would like to meet her. She's cool. Question number nine. <laughs> if you could be a superhero, who would you be? So it's kind of like that power you were talking about the other day, but what superhero would you be if you could be a superhero? Hawkeye! <laughs> perfectly okay. <laughs> that's surprising that <laughs> No, I didn't, because yeah. I know you like the character, and I bought you his little Funko Pop. You'd be Hawkeye? You want to shoot I a bow and arrow? That's cool. You think that's cool? <laughs> okay. I mean, whatever works for you. You're being rude. No, I'm not. <laughs> Do you have a second? I really like Iron Man. Okay, that's cool. So basically, you picked the two guys that really aren't superheroes. Shut up. Who would you pick? <laughs> Big fan of Wolverine. The singer? Yes, the singer. <laughs> also... Obviously, I like Deadpool, but I don't know if I'd want to be him. I think more I'd go your way and go Batman. He's yeah. definitely not a superhero. He's he just rich. has a cape and a mask. <laughs> Superpowers, he's rich. <laughs> At least Iron Man's smart. So is Batman. Not really. Yeah, he is. Okay, he is. Question. They're both rich. Because <laughs> one's DC and one's Marvel, and they're basically the same characters. No, 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 no. That's an insult. Next question. Question 10. What is your idea of the perfect... <laughs> What is your idea of the perfect day? Ooh, that's not what I thought you were going to ask. Um, I don't know. I, I mean, know. spending time with your friends, family, going somewhere, um, hang gliding, jumping out of a plane. My favorite day is Sunday. What are you doing? What jumping is... out of a plane? Did you say that? I've never done that That's before. Fernando's favorite day. No, thanks. Um, I don't know. A Sunday at Disney? That's pretty fun. A Sunday sitting on the couch having a gym session? That was that's today. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> What's yours? Oh uh, no, I'm Every gonna go. Every day spent with me. Yeah, for the most part. <laughs> I mean, you know, I it's, a, it's a toss up between spending a day with you and, and just spending a day by myself. Oh. Sometimes they both bring just as much joy. That's me. No, it's not. Every now and then you gotta have you me time. You noticed he didn't say you. <laughs> well, that was the family I'm just thing. Kidding. You never said that. Yeah, you, you didn't say that. I, I just said you said, said with you, with you no, or alone. I, I said mine was a lot like yours with family, and then you said, no, spending time with me. I have the tape. We can rewind it. All right, well, that was the 10 questions. Uh, we hope Wait, you guys, we what? Should, we have to make a question for them. We'll make a question for them. <laughs> I, I can't think of any. What's your favorite snack? I feel like that could vary. That could vary. give us good answers. That could very well give What's us good favorite? answers. It could very well. <laughs> well, but very snack is well. kind of a broad thing. I mean, obviously, I guess you'd consider ice cream a snack. No, 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 no. That's a dessert. Okay, so you want like a generic snack. Like, in the middle of the day, you're hungry, but it's not time for lunch, it's not time for dinner, it's not time for dessert, <laughs> it's not time for breakfast. It's snack time. I would say, like, barbecue chips Ooh. or, like, goldfish. That's I got you. No. Oh, what is mine? Chester's Cheese Popcorn. Oh, the Cheesy Pops? Poops. Cheesy Poops. Yes, definitely. Going. Yeah, Chester's Cheesy Poops. I like those. I like those a lot. Okay, and with that, thank you guys so much thank for you watching. For tuning in to Quarantine Q and A with your host Haley and Dean. Dean, Dean. yeah, <laughs> Dad, Dad, Dean. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Jason, so much for coming up with this list of 10 things. If there's questions that you guys have that you'd like us to answer, or by all means, video ideas. put a list up. We'll, I mean, we could always just sit here and play cards. That would be boring as hell. <laughs> Don't ask us to do that, please. All right, guys. You have a wonderful night, as always. Thank you for watching. Fernand, Haley. <laughs> and with that... <laughs> End the show, knucklehead. I lost what I was going to say. Don't Oh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and answer our question. Stay you guys, safe. Yes, yes. Stay safe. Have a good night. We'll talk to you later. Bye. Bye.